Now, Emily, you came here kind of to speak about your experience working with Brian, your omni-channel analytics journey. What has that really entailed? So we first decided to go with Call Miner because we were outsourcing our quality program. And, you know, typical three calls per agent per month. And we wanted to have more insight into our business. So now we're ingesting 2 million calls a month for customer care. And we're truly getting into the, d the deep and dirty insights of what's happening on our calls. How can it help us with training? How can it help us better forecast? How can it improve agent and customer experience? So we've used it for overall quality and then also to implement a compliance program. And what I love there, when you reference some of those questions, you said, how can it help us improve? How can it help us make things better? And that really is what I see as the beauty of analytics, the beauty of understanding your customers. It's not what's going on, it's what can we do? Now, Brian, how do you help organizations answer that question and drive positive change moving forward? Sure. Well, so. There are a number of use cases, and so every organization is different. And again, they'll have different drivers. So, you know, Emily uh, cited compliance as one of their elements, but they're equally passionate and obsessed with customer experience and wanting to get optimize that customer experience, achieve the highest level of customer satisfaction, and of course, customer retention. And so that's one particular driver, but there's a whole host of use cases, including a, an ever broadening interest now in using the data that's being derived from analytics, the billions of words that are spoken every day, and synthesizing them down into meaningful, actionable insights that can be used to apply across a whole variety of, of customer drivers of interest. So customer experience, operational efficiency, automated and more effective uh, quality assurance programs and whatnot. So the key is to understand what your customers are looking to do, start them off you know, on a, with a single or a couple of objectives, get them good at understanding those objectives and how they facilitate and improve in those areas, and then broadening their use cases and applications. And, and quite frankly, SiriusXM is our poster child for an organization that took that guidance, started with some simple applications and some simple objectives, achieved those, and by the way, stunning time frames, and, and then said, okay, what's next? So they're a great example, and, and not only just an example of a customer that's fully leveraging the insights of interaction analytics, but they're also really applying it to, uh, across their board, they're looking and understanding, hey, we've done this, now what's the next great idea?